what were you doing today? FTP test. Awesome. What was your last FTP test? Um, I got 225 last time, which was down from my previous time. My expectation is low for today. What's your FTP right now? Uh, currently I'm sitting at 271. How do you feel? Holy crap, 284. I just went up 13 watts. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Excited. That's so good. It's so mental, like, you get to the last, not only just like the last one that you know you're gonna be done on, but there's like different hurdles along the way. You get to the part where you last finished on before, and you're like, okay, this isn't feeling too bad. I'm gonna keep pushing. And once you get past that hurdle, it's a celebration in your mind, be like, I did it. How much longer can I push, pa push past this hurdle? And uh, I was able to push further than I thought. So, what's up? I'm so tired. How'd you feel about that? I felt good. Good. Are you happy? Yeah. Yeah. How much did you go up from your last one? Went up six watts. I'm at 231 now, which I'm happy with. Good. But like, man, at the end, it's like mentally you want to go more, but like my legs just gave out. Hey, what's going on, guys? So. Day number two of our testing. We are just heading out to the pool right now. We both have a thousand meter uh, swim test to do and then a 100 meter swim test on top of that. All right. So, you're about to start your 1,000 meters. How are you feeling? 1,000 meters for time. Um, I feel okay, but I haven't been doing many swims, so I have no idea of where I'm at. Okay. We'll see. Awesome. What's one of your issues that you're dealing with right now before you start the swim? One of my issues? Yeah. Split turning, probably, and just trying not to inhale water. <laughs> All right, so we're actually going to start at the exact same time, so I'm starting mine as well. I don't think I'm going to be flip turning. I'm going to just be able to touch the wall and go. And uh, Aaron's probably going to be done before me, but probably. the goal is to be here today. We'll see. finished in 15 minutes and 23 seconds. Yeah, I'm, I mean, I'm happy with that. That's my baseline. I haven't done a 1000 meter time trial in a really long time. I just wanted to document this because um, two years ago today, I remember I went into the lake with Spencer and he said he knew how to swim, but he couldn't even swim 
like 25 meters and now he's doing a 1000 meter time trial and he's doing so good and it's crazy that you can just put your mind to anything and learn something new even as an adult and it's just so cool you're done 1925 1925, Ooh. how do you feel? I feel good. Yo, it's the fastest I've ever swam. Yeah? Well, I think it's definitely in a pool though, but still, there's no wetsuit, nothing. Like, oh man. Oh, I saw it once, I saw a thousand meters. I just stopped. I'm like, I'm dying, I'm not going anymore. The fact that I was able to like pick up speed near the end and not be dead, like, I could have definitely done another thousand meters. So, yeah. Woo! You look good. Thank you. <laughs> Trying the form goggles. Hundred meter. Hundred meter time trial. Okay. Here we go. What'd you get? Um, a minute and twenty-two seconds. Okay, I'm going for a minute and twenty-two seconds. <laughs> One twenty four. Good job. <laughs> you sound like you have asthma. <laughs> that was the fastest I've ever swam. <sighs> Good job. All right, guys, we're down at Beachfront and it is a mess. There's so many people here, so it will be a little bit yeah. challenging to do this run, but we're gonna do the best we can. And uh, yeah, it's also super foggy out coming off the water, so I hope that doesn't affect our breathing, but uh, I feel like we should be okay. How are you feeling? I'm feeling good. I'm nervous, but hopefully in the 10 minutes of warm up, I'll be feeling a little bit better, so. Yeah, so we're not gonna bring the GoPro with us for this because it's just, I don't know, it's just too many people. I'm gonna poke somebody in the eye. Uh, There's too many people. <laughs> but yeah, we're just gonna jump into it and then uh, get back and uh, fill you guys in on how we're feeling. So, check back in a little bit. So, What's going on, guys? We just finished up. I ended up hitting a 20 minute and 46 second 5k, which I'm extremely happy with. Like the last time I did one was uh, two years ago and I did it in 22 minutes, but uh, wow, it is hot today. I think the Humidex is like a 79% humidity. Um, so I think maybe if it was a cooler day, I'd be able to chop you know, a couple seconds off the top of that 5k. I look forward to the testing again. How about you? I am super sweaty, but I, uh, I haven't looked at my time yet. I will get back to you. But um, I was happy that I was able to still do a one hour run after the 5K time trial. Holy crap. Yay, okay, I PR'd my 5K. I got 22 minutes and 27 seconds. Wow. Um, so my average pace was a 429. Wow, good job. That is so fast yeah, good job. for me. <laughs> Not like fast. So My best pace was a 405. Wow. That that's like so it's so funny because like we haven't been training speed really at all. Like we've just been doing like zone two heart rate, a little bit of sprinkle of like a little bit of speed, but we have not done like a solid effort. So we neither of us had any idea what we, were, what, uh, what we would be. Uh, so I, yeah. I, I just came off of a year, almost two years of uh, a leg injury or a knee injury, I don't even know what to call it, but basically that put me right out of the game for a long time and it's nice now that, you know, you get back out and start running again and I have to worry about it, so. I am shocked. A 429? Yeah, it's nuts. 